Thank you for your interest in learning about the Architect BES Sport 2. The Sport 2 is Architect's best-selling Keplerian bioptic system due to its quality optics, ease of fitting and prescribing, and its high patient acceptance. This short presentation will share with you everything you need to know to fit, prescribe, and order the BES Sport 2. Architect's innovative Keplerian optical design, called the Vision Enhancing System, or BES, Combine a telescope and a periscope together to create an ergonomically better designed spectacle mounted device. Instead of the image going straight through the system, the image enters through the front window, makes a right angle turn and goes across the front of the frame, and then makes another turn to enter the eye. All of Architect's systems have been designed to provide the widest field of view possible in a design that is comfortable to wear, appealing, and easy and convenient to fit and prescribe. Originally developed with grants from the National Eye Institute, Architect VES systems have been proven effective in independent clinical trials. The VES Sport is available in 4X, 5X, and 6X powers. The 4X provides a 12 and a half degree field of view and can focus to as close as nine inches. A 5X provides a 10 and a half degree field and focuses to as close as 10 inches. The 6X Sport provides a 9.6 degree field of view and can focus to as close as 12 inches. Architect offers the Sport in an array of colors, even hot pink, a favorite for many young ladies with albinism. The VES Sport is attached to the frame using the bridge mounting assembly as shown in photo one which includes a positioning rod that is held in place by two silver Phillips screws. Photo two shows the mounting sleeve on the back of the sport, which is slid over the positioning rod to hold the telescope in place. By loosening the Phillips screw slightly, the sport can be easily aligned for the eye that will be using the telescope. By further loosening the screws as shown in figure three, the telescope can be slid off the positioning rod and flipped over to allow it to be used by the fellow eye. Be careful not to loosen the screws too much to avoid disengaging them from the positioning rod. On occasion, and especially with smaller eye-sized frames, you may have to bend the frame slightly to completely disengage the telescope from the positioning rod. Once you've got the telescope positioned properly, just tighten the screws until they are snug and the telescope is not moved. There is no need to over-tighten the screws. There are just three simple steps to positioning the VES Sport 2. In step one, simply loosen the two silver Phillips screws slightly, but not so loose that the telescope won't stay in position. Then simply slide the sport right or left to align the eyepiece with the center of the patient's pupil. In step two, adjust the eyeglass frame nose pad so that the bottom of the eyepiece aligns with the top of the pupil. In step three, Ask the patient to drop their head down slightly and look up into the eyepiece and adjust the telescope viewing angle to match your patient's line of sight. That's all there is to it. Practice it a few times with a staff member and you'll find just how easy it is to do. The VES Sport eyepiece extends through the carrier lens in order to offer the widest field of view possible. When you order the system, the carrier lens will be slotted to allow the eyepiece to pass through. The slot is made slightly oversized to allow for fine tuning at the dispensing visit. Once you have determined the ideal position of the eyepiece, use a millimeter rule to measure from the center of the bridge to the center of the eyepiece to determine the proper eyepiece position. Architect's metal frames are available in three styles, the K, the unisex, and the sleek. They are available in a full range of eye sizes and colors and with both skull and cable temple options. Even pediatric sizes are available. The eye size of each frame is engraved on the left side of the center of the bridge as shown in the red circle. Visit Architect's website for complete frame information. All frames are provided with large nose pads and a head strap to help keep the systems firmly in place when worn.
Patients rarely have difficulty seeing everything they need to see when their visual acuity is 2040. It's reasonable then to use 2040 as the prescribing goal for acuity through the telescope. Prescribing a higher power device will be at the cost of a narrower field of view. So the 4X sport will be appropriate for individuals with best corrected distance visual acuity of 2160, the 5X for 2200, and the 6X for 2240. Many prescribers will accept 2050 as an acceptable acuity goal, so the 4X may be helpful for individuals with 2200, the 5X 2240, and the 6X for individuals with 2300 as corrected visual acuity. Visually impaired individuals with central vision loss from genetic and developmental disorders, as well as individuals with well-circumscribed age-related macular defects, usually respond very well to the VES Sport 2. We recommend that you prescribe carry lenses consistent with what your patient normally wears, even bifocals. We suggest that you avoid trifocals and progressives as there is usually insufficient room in the frame to provide adequate distance viewing area. Be certain to provide at least 10 millimeters from the bottom of the eyepiece to the top of the bifocal segment. Architect's frame text sheet lists suggested bifocal segment heights. If you're not certain what to specify, just write standard on the order form and Architect's order department will know what to do. Since the VES Sport has a very wide focusing range, most all distance refractive errors can be covered without an eyepiece correction. If during testing your patient is achieving the acuity goal you seek without an eyepiece correction, then none is needed. Eyepiece correction should be considered with spherical refractive errors beyond plus or minus 12 or with cylinders above three diopters. The VES Sport focuses to very close working distances using the central focusing wheel and as such reading caps are rarely needed. However, snap-on reading caps are also available in most any power you choose. Architect also offers slip-behind sun filters in five colors that match the shapes of all Architect metal frames. They can be ordered with or without a slot, so you can specify whether you want the telescope eyepiece to be covered by the filter or left open. Snap-on filter caps are also available in all five filter colors. Architect has produced a convenient bioptic prescribing worksheet that will take you step by step through the process of demonstrating bioptics, determining the prognosis, and for making prescribing decisions. Feel free to contact Architect to request your copy of this very helpful form. To support the low vision specialist, Architect has strived to make telescope prescribing as easy, convenient, and risk free as possible. Our very knowledgeable technical support staff is available to answer all of your questions. Thanks so much for your interest. Feel free to contact us to learn more about Architect's full range of telescopic products for the visually impaired.